Hey guys and welcome back to Oxygen Not Included, Clay Space Colony Adventure Extraordinaire where we are having a few few issues actually. Well the one of the main ones that we've got is we appear to be completely out of anything resembling algae. You can see over here we've got an issue with that. So I think we're going to expand our uh, slime brewery over there. Let's have a look. Uh, naturally robust mouth breather. I'm not sure about the mouth breather, breather. We seem to be having a few problems with oxygen. We've got a loud sleeper, uncultured, tinkering. None of these particularly scream out to me. Um, no, no. In fact, there we go. We're gonna, we're gonna reject them. Uh, if if we had, we do have room for one more, and at some point we will definitely take them on. But that was not the person right now. We also have this kind of false thing on the go. Why is this not working? Max gas pressure. So we need to try and figure out a way of getting all this hydrogen out of here quicker. I thought maybe the extra grates would help, but obviously it's kind of bottlenecking in this corner over here. It can't quite escape through this quick enough. So what I'm going to try first, before I do anything serious, if I could get my priorities back, let's do this and this. Uh, I am worried about it escaping out this way. I don't know if that's a thing that will happen. Uh, also, this is still only a one wide tile gap so I don't know if that's going to help at all. I'll tell you what we will do. We'll deconstruct this one. Someone should be along very quickly to make that a thing. Let's, let's speed up here. Anybody? Anybody along? Any second now. Lots of food needs to get harvested. Does the bri do the bristle blossoms? Sorry, um, do they drop automatically when they go through their entire cycle? Uh, I'm not sure if that's actually a thing or not. Uh, I'm going to put this on nine sandstone, just like that, and then we can pop in some more gas permeable tiles. This one is pretty high. It's awaiting a copper delivery. Let's have a look here. Now that's mineral. I wanted the metals. We've got a lot of copper. This, this shouldn't be holding us back at all. Really shouldn't. Uh, Turner coming in and doing the sandstone. Okay, great, great, great. Now with that in place, I want to go gas permeable. Uh, again, just out of copper, nine. And that should allow us to have a little bit more flow going through this corner here. What? What's back there? Oh, there's a pipe back there. Of course, that's where all the hydrogen is escaping from. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Okay, it's telling me we're going to have a food shortage today, so I'm going to harvest at high priority, just go through. We can't wait for it all to drop now anymore. Uh, I don't know if we are just constantly losing food now or not, or whether I just I haven't prioritised harvesting. Uh, so I'm going to have to try and keep on top of that. Just keep an eye on it. Just keep an eye on it. Maybe we will uh, expand our farms out over here. I mean, we're going to end up digging out all this slime eventually anyway. So it would be a good idea to do so. Speaking of, let's uh, put a few things down over here. We want to refine. I want to go buy a distillery again. Uh, we want to keep some space. We want to keep some space, but not that much. Let's press X and destroy this wall. I know it took us forever to build it, but there we go. It's going to go down like that this time uh, nine sandstone just rip that across there like that let's let's see how that bodes for us it should it should go quite well should go quite well uh, the distillery was what I wanted could someone just finish this little job for me here uh, something else I wanted to do whilst whilst we're hanging around here I want to put one of these in here because uh, I feel waiting for the oxygen to go around this corner to get deodorized they're deodorized. It's a little bit of a waste. It's a little bit of a waste. We could just do it here and then rip this one up. And then I think that should work a lot better for us. I hope so. Anyway, that, that is the plan. If it doesn't work for us, I'll have to try and find another plan. Uh, so... Do we just want to leave the one gap in between or two? Let's let's just go for the one. Let's uh, put down that many. Now, I'm not sure if our water services can handle this, so we might have to put its own little water purifier in, which, of course, would mean we'd probably need our own power system. In fact, I think we're probably going to need our own power system anyway. Do I want to expand this little area out and have a new uh, coal generator down? It could be a thing. It could definitely be a thing. Let's have a look at what's going on here. A lot of carbon dioxide. We could also destroy these two algae terrariums, knock a hole in the side, and let all the carbon dioxide flow down here to these ones, where is our central sort of carbon dioxide catchment area. So yeah, let's do that. Let's uh, deconstruct this, deconstruct this. This might be a bad idea. This might very well be a bad idea. Uh, we want the gas purple tiles. Let's pop two of those in. Carbon dioxide is heavy, so it should fall down, right? That that That's a thing, yeah. Uh, and I want to put in some... 
more generators okay so a couple of gas permeable tiles to sit some batteries on I, I do like the idea of that that's that's quite nice uh, power coal generator do we want to fit two in again it's a bit heat heavy but I think we're gonna do it I think we're gonna do it the reason I think we're gonna do it is because there's this wheeze wart here it's sat on granite that's pretty good let's uh, take this up this side like here yeah that that should work for us, right? That should work. And just kind of dig this area out. Uh, I'm going to rip up this central wall here. I don't want to say all, do I? That's that's a bad idea. Let's cancel all that. I want to rip up buildings. Yes, indeed, indeed. Just rip up this bit here. Uh, I might even cancel these. These just don't feel like they're in the right place. Um, let's, let's grab power, coal generator. There... Yeah, it leaves a little bit more room. Uh, just, just feels a bit better. Just feels a bit better. And so uh, do this. If I, I might just call up the priorities. Might just call up the priorities. Let's run that down there. Yeah, let's do this. Let's do this. Pull this out. So, some are nine, some aren't. I'm, I'm going to turn them all to eight. Uh, hopefully that will tick over wonderfully well. Oh, here comes Ikroy and Turner. They're not really doing the full job though. It's a little disappointing. Uh, a couple of batteries would probably do wonders here and here. It's what we've designed this for. And I've got to think about how we're going to break this system off from everything else. Where would where would a good place be for a decent water purifier? Or do we just feed it all? No, we can't we can't feed it all into this water system. Yeah, look, this is this is backing up like no one's business. So it definitely needs to get sorted on its own. Perhaps we can make some clean water here. A lot of clean water here and then pump that down and across this way and join in here that might that might be a good idea and we just pump it all out down here I'm not sure if that's enough we might have just have to put a second liquid vent in Wow some of these people aren't even getting to bed till morning that that's crazy that's crazy uh, I'm gonna put one of these in this level here as they seem to be failing on the clean oxygen so let, let's make this a thing that they can be proud of somewhere that they want to come and stay that does not need to be so high there we go awesome awesome this however does and it would be nice if someone fixed this you know let's let, let's get this this bit looking as nice as this maybe having as nice oxygen i like the fact that we keep getting extra oxygen pumped in from here that, that that's a good idea what dirty oxygen which we then turn into clean oxygen via the power of these air deodorizers i noticed that the uh, the concentration here just keeps climbing up which is very nice which is very nice i wonder how the diffusion is happening here because i don't see any polluted oxygen actually coming up this way yet still this this must be cleaning Anyway, back to the power system. Everyone seems to be digging quite well. I've turned everything up on the priority here. Look at how much water is down here, though. That'll be melted from this lot. They're taking their time digging, though. It's the Abyssalite. It's got to be the Abyssalite. It's always so hard to, to hack through, turns out. Uh, granite is fine. How are we going to... Well, once these get dug... No, uh, I was thinking about how we're going to drain the water from this place. That said, I think the... Uh, the coal generators burning up some heat should should help there, right? Should help. Hydrofan turning itself over. Oh, here comes Jupiter McDuke face to uh, to do it for us. That's it's an interesting state of affairs, really, isn't it? May have changed my mind about these gas permeable tiles because obviously, like with these terrariums being here it makes a sort of a, a little area for people to come and stand while they need to work in here because obviously people do need to come and work in here so let's let's do this instead let's get rid of these gas permeable tiles and we will seal it back in so so that these can do their job and turn it into some oxygen and everyone can be happy is everybody happy i hope so i hope so the one place i might actually oh oh there goes some dirty water that's that's not the best actually that's not the best the one place i might crack a few gas permeable tiles in would be down here let's um do something like this let's set this to an eight let's see if we can dig through that lot if we can do that that would be good so we've got this kind of cloud of chlorine just sat here and it's really not doing well for the people trying to <laughs> Ruby, that's not how you work that. Uh, the, the people trying to make some power here. It's not doing them well. And I'm wondering what we can do about this. Now, I could just put a gas um, gas pump in here and siphon it off. But I, I wouldn't even know where to put it afterwards. Hmm. We might even have to break this generator to 
fit the pump in. Because we're, we're quite tight for room here. We're quite tight. Okay, we're at the final stages of putting this coal power plant together. So I'm going to go into refinement. We're going to grab a water purifier. I'm literally just going to put it down the bottom here. Uh, yeah, 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 just like that. I'm going to break the pipes that are behind here. Now, this is going to make a small spill of polluted water. I think we can live with it. I think we can live with it. Going from about here to about here, something like that. Let's hit this button, that one, as well well that's pretty good that's pretty good we need to get some plumbing on the go a little bit of liquid piping this one comes down here these go across join oh <laughs> that, that was exactly what i was doing join all of these together like so okay that's pretty good that's pretty good uh now this is the hard bit we need to figure out how to get this liquid piping coming all the way back with this so we're gonna go down um i think we're literally just gonna kind of follow it across like this yeah, we can even go down and across and then join in as previously stated here. Now, I actually want to build some gas parable tiles here. So with this in place, let's go tile here if you could, followed by two of these. Okay, that should make everything a little bit easier. New duplicate. I just want another delivery person. Can we can we do so divers lungs? Yokel, yeah, we need a new name though. We need a new name. Um, <laughs> Runner Alpha, <laughs> welcome. You are definitely not a number. Um, okay, let's get in here. Jobs as soon as we can get it right down at the bottom. Runner Alpha, let's clear all these off and literally just deliver and, and combat as well. Uh, anyone who's not on combat should be put onto combat. Uh, like so yeah there we go okay that that should set everything up pretty well again okay the next thing we need to do is obviously isolate this power system from uh the other one yes indeed that's that's how we isolate is make sure that two are separate so if we do something like this come up here across i think i just want to break the wires here so let's uh deconstruct wires just, just kind of drag that across like that Something like that. Let's F3. Uh, no, not F3. F2. See if I got... Oh, I got that. Perfect. Perfect. So heavy watt wire once again. Coming up and across. And let's get all these in place. Night time. Brilliant. Just, just what we want. Well, at least everything else has been built. Now, if I pull out here and have a look at the priorities. Yeah, we, we, we got some low numbers here. I'm wondering whether eights are even going to get touched. But we'll we'll see. We'll see. Let's, let's put all these in and see what happens down like this cross yeah no th these are okay these are okay okay so the disconnecting happens immediately let's see let's see what else happens immediately not much people are going to go around fill out uh, fill in all the filtration mediums first before anything oh look at this this bad boy over here let's put him on an eight see how long it takes for him to get fixed uh also it has the hatch moved he's not He's back, he's back there. That's not where we want him. We want him up there. That's a little un inconvenient. A little inconvenient. Is this flowing any better over this side? I see it's mainly oxygen here now. That's pretty good. It does max, ga max gas pressure a lot, though, still. That's, that's a little more unfortunate. Probably would have done a lot better just to keep this over there or move these over this way. Maybe moving these over this way would be the thing. I just like the idea of having the, uh, the through, through flow. Okay, so I've upped the priority on these liquid pipes because I thought it might be a good idea to get this in place before we start firing everything up. Uh, I'm not... Oh, have I put everything in as obsidian? Doesn't It doesn't really matter. Pipes can be made out of whatever. It just means that they need to go running back and forth quite a lot to go and fetch the obsidian. Well, we could have just got the, uh, the sandstone here. So th th there is a little unfortunate side to that, but th that'll be fine. Uh, are they going to immediately start digging through, though? I don't know. Uh, I've kind of run this along here and put this second layer on the same priority of dig hey what's going on down here okay that's an interesting way of reaching i didn't think they'll do that so that i can then punch some gas permeable tiles in as i was saying i would do batteries are sufficiently full yet still the hydrogen generator burns me you, you can't dance your way well it looks like you can dance your way to power that's pretty cool man it's pretty cool 
Okay, the power lines are going in. We haven't quite got all the liquid pipe in place. There's just this little bit left to do, but I think it's good enough to start firing up a little coal generator here. Hopefully this now should have a positive knock-on effect to all this. This should all start flowing up pretty well. Uh, we've got the number of joules is, being, is increasing, so that, that's cool. Uh, awaiting filtration medium. What an oversight. So let's turn that up and see who will come along and do that. At someone, anybody, anytime, any place. That would be cool if we could start getting algae to flow again. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. Now, the thing I am super interested in is when this starts making water... Not pumping. Oh, of course it's not pumping because we haven't got this done yet. What are our priorities here? Yeah, they're super high. If you could do them, guys, that would be great. Thank you. Uh, let's put some ladders, nine, uh, like so, across like that. I, th I think that looks pretty good. I think that looks pretty good. We, we just need to get this all connected up now. It's literally everywhere up to here. But th this, as I say, is the point that I'm a little bit worried about. You can see that we've got like four, uh, three or four kilograms of water in there already. And I'm not sure what the maximum is we can take. There's a five kilogram there. Um, but it, yeah, it worries me because I think we're going to need like six. So maybe we could just carry on here and put another liquid duct. That that, that would be something that I would consider doing. Uh, let's let's think about where we would put ladders for that. Let's let's do this quickly whilst we're waiting. That and that can be a go there. Uh, how about you guys? Are we we good over here? We're not quite doing as well as I thought we would. Obsidian's being picked up and transported around. Okay, yeah, no, they're working on it. It's just taking a little bit of a while. How much obsidian do we have? We have loads, and it's just scattered all over the place. Like, literally everywhere. That That is a thing. No, oh, look, there's a hatch alive up here. Well, he, he can uh, chow down on all the sandstone we're dropping. That'll be fine. Okay, so I've noticed that there's a little bit of a problem here. Where they can only get at one bit at a time, they come along, they make a delivery, and then they run away, and then someone else needs to come in and then do the dig. So what I'm going to do is kind of open up this space underneath, hopefully, and we can get these guys doing a little bit more work than what they're currently involved in you see that how one comes up and then one has to disappear it's a little bit of a waste of time okay suddenly many people down here working i know it's all on different things but it's encouraging to see it is encouraging to see maybe if we pop these ladders onto a slightly higher priority as well that would also help everything falling to the floor that's fine though because there are several hatch that live down here uh so that that that's cool that means that we can uh, keep them well fed would probably like to move all this water Let, let's do this shall we mop on a nine yeah why not everything's on nine <laughs> everything is on nine super kitty draws the uh, short straw there cleaning up all the nasty water meep as well long-term polluted water mopper that's pretty cool uh the lack of oxygen down here is a bit of a problem but at the same time there is some polluted stuff they, they, they can live with it they can live with it well i can live with it they they will suffer for it new duplicant okay let's do this choose a duplicant um mole hands yokel i mean you could be a new miner that that would be a lot of interesting things to be done for you <laughs> yokel narcoleptic grease monkey that i might just take you for the full full impact of everything you've got just look look at all this just like print let's let's take you Lindsay. was it let's have a look down here yeah brilliant uh, are you any good at art? This is, no, not really. Okay, so let's take those away. Uh, the power sweep build. I'm going to leave deliver, though. We're going to leave deliver. Let's, let's see what you can do. There was a lot of stuff there that you're doing, and hopefully you can go and do them really well. Man, these last few are pretty painful to watch. Someone comes in, does a little bit of the job, then runs away, as, as I was saying earlier. But then nighttime will come along, and still, like everybody for these last two bits of pipe it's literally just two bits of pipe how how much do i need this i need it a lot uh algae is low and that is of course why when i say algae is low we are out of algae and all i want to do is connect these pipes so this purifier can turn on and then these guys can start spinning out oh look we've got a, a new bio distiller here we need to connect this guy up uh, he's connected up like that what about with power though i think this might be yeah okay cool that's that's good that's good i have pre-planned that's that's a rarity for for me uh on eight i think we're gonna do this i would put it up again higher but you know we've got a lot of jobs going like that already duper mcduper face coming to top up the battery it's 
wasn't below 50%. I'm, I'm a little bit surprised that he did that. Uh, we are doing well, though, because this water was about here when we started pumping, and it's just rolling and rolling and rolling. Uh, I'm not sure. Yes, we are filling up the stocks here. That's, that's pretty cool. It would have been nice to have got this polluted water out first, but I will live with that. I will. Ah, uh, just one left to go. People will come along and do it. We still are waiting for the delivery first. Okay, so who is there a way of clicking on that and seeing who's in charge of the job? No, there's not, unfortunately. That That's a little bit... Well, unfortunate, as I have just said. I just saw something, where was it? Industrial ingredient, what's this? Reed fibre. I've managed to pick up some reed fibres. Ah, oh, they're just kind of laying around on the floor. We will get round to doing some clothing at some point. I'm just still struggling with survival, you know. Uh, but it should be fine. Last one, go... Dig and deliver? No, well, I suppose he delivered and dug. So that that's all cool. We need someone to build, though. Is Abe a builder? Can you do it, Abe? No, no, he can't. Uh, who, who is going to be the man? Who's going to be the, the girl? Who is going to be the person that comes along and does these things? It's not Runner Alpha. Oh, no, it's it, Croy. Yes, it is. Come on, come along and do this job for me. Bam! That's what we wanted. So hopefully now this is pumping away. Yep, we've got some algae being produced. And I am going to say thank you very much for joining me for this adventure, ladies and gentlemen. I will see you next time where maybe, actually just maybe, we will get around to doing a little bit of clothing. Uh, we've got this septic tank still being built taken a long time to get this built actually um and maybe we can clean the water up but we've got the little self-filtration unit on the go there but i will see you then when we're gonna do all of that bye